Hi everyone, this is Megan with AboveRubyStudio.com. Thank you so much for joining me today. I'm going to show you a really quick, fun birthday card using some All A Flutter Wings and Things, All A Flutter Flut All A Flutter Flutter By from My Little Shoebox Paper. I'm going to be making a quick little birthday card. I have some cardstock here that matches really well. I'm not sure where it's from. It was just in my stash of things, but it's eight and a half by eleven, so I'm going to cut it in half, and I'm going to cut it. <clears throat> long ways at four and a quarter. So we're going to make a portrait card today. And it's pretty thick so I'm going to score it at five and a half. Just like that. Okay. And what I'm going to use from this paper today is these two flowers up here. I'm just going to cut them out really quick and simple. I've already cut out um, a couple of the butterflies on this page and I used it in another project that you can actually view over at customcrops.com. I did it for them um, as a design team project and I'm just using up the rest of this paper. I think it's so, so cute and um, you can get this paper at customcrops.com. And I'm not being real particular with how I'm cutting this out. I'm using big scissors to get kind of a choppy look. You can see that there's um, the way the paper is even doodled out and designed, it's kind of just fun and doodled. So I'm just adding to that effect with a choppy scissor cut. If I wanted to get a precision cut, you would want to use a finer set of scissors. I actually really recommend the uh, Tim Holtz Tonic scissors. They are awesome. Oh my goodness, they are so awesome. And they can really get good clean cuts for intricate projects and things. Now what I actually want to use is this top strip up here. This is going to be the main um, focal point of my card. And I'm going to be cutting it right along this stitch line here. Right below it. So kind of where that yellow and green meet. I'm going to want to cut off this barcode here at the top. And I'm going to make this four and a quarter. I'm actually going to go ahead and just make it a little bit bigger than four and a quarter so that I can trim off what I don't need instead of trying to line it up exactly. So this will go right along the front of my card. And I also really want, I know it's in the middle of the page, but that's okay. I want this red polka dot strip. So I'm going to go ahead and cut it out. And this I'm actually going to cut to five and a half inches because I think I'm going to use it landscape style, or I'm sorry, portrait style, not landscape style. And I also have some green pattern ribbon here. Um, I picked up at Michael's in their dollar bins, always a plus. So I'm gonna start by gluing ATG gun down this little piece here. Okay. I'm going to, since it comes opens here, I'm going to make sure I line it up real good at the top. And then I can trim off anything that hangs over, which there isn't much, but I'll just trim off what hangs over. Just gonna use some scotch, scotch adhesive. I want this to kind of go underneath a little bit, so I'm just gonna let that stick like so. Okay, and I know I want this here. So again, I'm going to ATG. I really want this adhered down. This has a long way to go. This is for a very special little girl. It's for my stepdaughter. I want to say happy birthday to Riley. It's her birthday. And I thought she would really like the butterflies and the colors of this card. So this is especially for her. So happy birthday, Riley girl, we love you. Okay, for my ribbon, I'm actually going to tie it. So I'm gonna come underneath. I want it to tie on this side. I just wanna make sure I turn my ribbon so that the pattern stays sticking out on both sides when I knot it. And I'm going to cut it in little angles. And this flower I'm going to pop dot up here. Just like so. 
And finally, I have this really sweet stamp that says Make a Wish on it. And I'm going to stamp it with some red lipstick, um, fluid chalk ink. Right down here. Okay. So there is my card for today. Again, a very special happy birthday to Riley. I have a fun, fun, fun gift to send to her today. And um, this is just one of the fun little cards that are going to be in that fun packet. So I hope you have a great day, and I will see you very soon. Thank you again for watching AboveRubyStudio.com. Bye.